say what I just did? Wait, let me do it again. Did you catch it that time? You don't know? Well, I'll explain. Just because you turn around, walk away, does not mean nor make you a coward or show that you're weak because it takes somebody mighty strong to walk away from a very very unnecessary fight see like for instance see that Probably can't see because of the light, but that's a massive bruise on my arm. Now I got that bruise, it's fighting, firing off a single bear 12 gauge shotgun. Fired it off twice in a row. Turkey shot. Take somebody mighty strong to fire off 12 gauge, don't it? Because a lot of people scare of something that you could possibly consider a hand cannon. A lot of people are scared of them, much less touch them and shoot them but in reality needless to say it takes somebody mighty strong to walk away from an unnecessary fight yeah you can stand there you can be beat you can beat back but no no what are you solving what are you accomplishing especially speaking from a man's perspective you can beat somebody's fucking ass all day long but in their mind they're gonna be building up that hate building up that vengeance that they want to bestow upon you and they'll come back next time they won't do it straight to your face instead like a lot of them are nowadays they'll come up from you when you least expect it right behind you and hit you with something other than their fists or even in worst case scenarios well, we all know what worst case scenarios are, don't we? Many of it, many of them lose their lives over for something petty. Say, for instance, as petty as a cigarette. A cigarette. Easy to get. Easy to do. After all, it's still a drug in a lot of people's eyes. In a lot of other people's eyes, stress relief. So all you little ignorant people out there, mind your own business. Quit judging others, least you judge yourselves for what you do behind doors. Because you make a lot of people mad when you go to start assuming things that you know the least bit of a grain of salt about. So I'm going to leave you with that. It's my first video that I haven't done in, in a little while. So I'm going to leave you with that. Mind your own business. Don't stick your nose where it does not need to be. After all, A-B conversation. See your way out of it.